guys, what's going on? Coach Frank here at the Critical Bench Compound. And in today's video, I wanna walk you through how to train your triceps using dumbbells only. So in this video, I'm gonna walk you through the triceps muscle, explaining to you what the execution of that muscle is, how to actually take it through its proper range of motion, and then how to incorporate utilizing dumbbells and give you guys a couple different exercises that you can then take and program into your workouts, into your training, to get the full benefit and full maximal muscle development outside of those triceps. So for anybody out there that is unfamiliar with what is the triceps, so it's this back part of, of our arm. So there's three muscle heads that incorporate or make up the triceps, which obviously hence the word tri. So triceps equals three. So you have, uh, it's, it's involved with extension of the elbow. So that's, that's one thing. And then it's also involved with kicking, kicking back here. So I'm gonna walk you through each, uh, a couple of the different exercises utilizing these dumbbells. The first one is gonna be a seated dumbbell extension. So I'm gonna sit on the, the dumbbell here and what this is gonna do is this is gonna work the triceps through its lengthened position. So every muscle has what's known as a lengthened position where it's more stretched and then a shortened or fully contracted position. So some of the other exercises we do will focus more on that contraction piece. But getting our, our, our arm extended over above our head, you can do the single arm, you can do them dual arm. Basically all we're looking to do is keep this top part of our arm fully locked and loaded and we're just extending at the elbow, okay? So if I was gonna do this in two hands, I'd keep my elbows naturally where they wanna fall. Sometimes people are gonna tell you that you wanna squeeze in here, but, if, but it's, it's best to just let the elbows fall where they naturally wanna go. And then you're gonna extend it up, fully squeezing and contracting. And what you'll notice with this extension movement is you really feel a good stretch when you get down here at the bottom. So this is where I talked about, this is training it in its lengthened state or lengthened position. So that would be one movement that you can utilize using a dumbbell. Now another one is gonna be what's called a tricep kickback. So thinking of, of the, the, the elbow as an extender, we can extend it up over this way or we can extend it back this way. Putting the, the arm in this position, what it forces you to do is keep your arm locked back and your tricep attaches to your lat muscle. So by keeping it back here, you're actually further shortening the muscle. So this is a better exercise to work it in this more contracted state. So what you'll do is grab your dumbbell in a single hand, okay, give yourself something to firmly brace on. Focus on extending back or hence kicking back like the exercise is called. Okay, and just balance it off. Make sure to complete both arms. All right, so those would be two, two different movements that you can utilize, just triceps or just dumbbells, I'm sorry. Before we move on guys to the, the final exercise, I wanna tell you about this free giveaway that we have here today. Obviously building, building a great body, putting on muscle, losing fat, it's important what you do in the gym. Yes, we're all here learning these exercises, but even more important is what you put into your body outside of the gym. So what we wanna do guys is we wanna give you our brand new delicious anabolic protein shakes and smoothies and a free Critical Bench Shaker Cup. All you gotta do is visit the first link down there in the pinned comment, enter in your email address, and we're gonna send this to you guys absolutely free of charge. Just pay for shipping. But moving on guys, I'm gonna give you one more movement, and it's a pressing movement. A lot of people think pressing is shoulders and chest, and yes, that is the primary mover of our, of our pressing uh, exercises, but also what's involved is the back of the arm or, or the triceps, they operate as a secondary mover. So taking our same dumbbells and utilizing just a, just a flat bench, I'm gonna lean back here. Okay, and whereas with a normal chest press, I would go real wide and focus on bringing my elbows in. Here, I'm gonna keep my hands in a neutral position, <sighs> drop the elbows down and extend back up. Now you will feel your chest, you will feel your triceps in this exercise and that's okay. Our triceps are operating as a secondary mover. But as you can see, what I was telling you guys, the tricep is the extender and that pressing movement as we bring it up, our elbow is getting into full extension. So. Utilizing dumbbells is important to first understand what is the muscle trying to do? What is the function of this muscle? Once you understand that, you can then take exercises and build a pro 
a productive or proactive plan to fully maximize the training of that muscle. So hope you guys enjoyed this video, training your triceps utilizing only dumbbells. All right guys, so there you have it. Everything you need to know and do in the gym or at home training your triceps with just dumbbells. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. And like I said at the beginning guys, if you're looking for some meal plan recipes, looking for some protein shake smoothies, I want you to click that first link down there in the pinned comment. We're gonna give you our delicious anabolic protein shakes and smoothies and a free critical ba uh, bench shaker cup. Absolutely free, you just cover the shipping. But we'll see you guys on the other side. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to subscribe, hit that like button. We'll see you guys in the next video.